Prime Minister Tong Sing Tambobong leads Lao delegation attends Korea ASEAN summit, which opens for strategic partnership. Our news team Gong Kam Duang Gao and Peng Kan Ti have the atmosphere from Busan. Prime Minister Tong Sing Tambobong leads Lao delegation attends Korea ASEAN summit, which opens for strategic partnership. At the high-profile gathering, ROK President Park Geun-hye on Thursday launched the special summit with 10 leaders of the Association of Southeast Asian Nations called ASEAN in the country's southeastern city of Busan. The 2014 ASEAN South Korea Commemorative Summit ran for two days through Friday. Opening the special summit, the CEO Summit with business leaders was held first at the Busan Exhibition and Convention Center. ROK President Park Geun-hye said in a keynote speech that South Korea and the ASEAN have developed a mutually beneficial cooperation relationship, stressing the need for further efforts to foster their economic partnership a leap forward. The ASEAN, including Brunei, Cambodia, Indonesia, Laos, Malaysia, Myanmar, the Philippines, Thailand, Singapore and Vietnam, emerged as a key trade partner of South Korea since the two sides launched dialogue in 1989. The two sides signed a free trade agreement or FTA in May 2006 which more than doubled trade volume between them. Trade between South Korea and the ASEAN rose from about 61 billion US dollars in 2006 to more than 130 billion US dollars in 2013. ASEAN is the number two trade partner of South Korea following China and the third largest investment destination of South Korean companies. To boost bilateral economic partnership, Park made three proposals during the CEO summit including further cooperation in the services industry, further liberalization through bilateral FTAs, and active participation of small companies in global value chain. After meeting with some 570 businessmen, ROK President Park Geun-hye also hold back-to-back -back meetings with ASEAN leaders, the special summit hosted by the ROK President on Friday.